I just thought, oh my gosh, this is going to be the next big deal. We've had to enable technologies to move the camera independently over the action, either up in the air or on the ground. In my case for figure skating, I, I could see this being in every rink all over the world. It was, it was just a crazy experience. I wanted to like walk around in the place. Incredible, I felt like I would just reach out and touch everything. It's amazing to be able to turn your head and see a whole 360 view of the event that's going on. Unless you've taken a look at it, it's almost hard to describe the, uh, the effect that the virtual reality has on, uh, on your mind and just your perception. For us, it was motion. How do we put the camera into the middle of the action and catch it? Can you imagine if these cameras could move with people in a human-like manner? We have solved VR locomotion through stabilization, autonomy, and machine learning. The director no longer gets caught in the take. It's not enough to have a virtual reality camera stuck to a tripod. You can direct remotely have the cameras follow the host or a group of people. The locomotive platform for VR was meant to bring life to virtual reality. The problem with VR is that cameras are stuck and life does not work that way. We are alive and it is the most exciting thing 